Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2015 with the Rude Man, and we're back in Nebraska. And I have equipment spread all over Hell's Half Acre. Um, we were just tying up our um, harvest, and I just—I'll just show you. I've got—I've got equipment out everywhere. It's just everywhere but what I was trying to do was I was trying to finish the harvest and at the same time replant all the fields which I've kind of been keeping up with so if we take a look at uh, at this I've reseeded oh I missed field three I need to go get field three uh, I've reseeded all of this but I need to get field three so let's finish up with five and I finished 21. I'm working on this. I did uh, cut around these berms. So I'm hoping that that'll help. So I guess there's no time like the present. Let's get started with these uh, combines. And we were using auto wash. So we'll continue on with that. This guy is just in this little bitty area right here and then he can continue on with the with the main cutting area of the field and let's see if we can get this guy I made one pass down the middle if you can see it kind of down there in the distance to make this uh, just a little triangular to give him a little bit of a hand and then let's start this guy also on auto wash. What, 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 wait, wait, where are you going? Uh, yeah, I got, he's going the wrong way. How did that happen? How did that happen? Because I haven't changed it since I left. That's kind of weird. All right, uh, and then this guy is kind of ready to go. We'll get him started. And I don't know if this is the right angle to take him or not. I think they're going to hit those telephone poles. I may have to switch my thoughts on this one. But we'll work on it. Okay, so. Yeah, it won't take him long to finish that little that little area right here. Alright, so let's get some trucks going here. These guys are just waiting. Uh, I got them caught up to the fields that were harvested. Except for, we do need to take one over to field three. Where are they all? Okay, this guy is at field six. We'll leave him there. We'll take, uh, well, yeah, let's take this guy. Over to field three. I don't want to go on the tarmac. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go cross country because these guys don't do well on the cement or the asphalt, whichever the case may be. I was eating a piece of black licorice and I bought and I bit the inside of my cheek and it wasn't fun. And so now I'm in pain. I hate when that happens. I guess it's God's way of telling me quit eating sugar. Actually I didn't do it too bad. I bit myself worse. But it's still painful.
Oh, woe is me. Okay. Let's line this sucker up. And have at it. Yeah, I didn't do a too good a job today, but oh well. It'll catch up eventually. Alrighty, and here we are. This is field six. Um, just These two guys are just waiting for field five or field 21 to get finished, whichever comes first. And he's just waiting until the time he's needed. Um, Uh-oh. Field five needs a tractor. So... Let's see. We can't use him. He's got corn in him. Uh, this guy. We'll take him over. Oh, this guy here can be reseeded. Field 20. All these weird shaped fields. catch up with this guy before the other combine catches up to him. Not quite sure which one is needing to be refilled. I should look. Is it him? Nah, I think he's just done with his job. No, no, no. It must be him. Now we're going to have to stop him if we don't. He's going to take off as soon as he drops a couple of kernels. Well, maybe the start of summer's here. I just finished doing a recording of Manchester and I mentioned that it was uh, 75 degrees outside that's a scorcher for us uh, just yesterday it was only 50 and that's what happens here at the coast uh, we'll have you know 45 50, it got down to 43 degrees the night before last I'm not quite sure what it did last night but it always cools down in the evening the thing is, we don't get warm weather for any length of time. We'll have we'll have uh, days of 50 degrees, and then all of a sudden have a, se uh, a 75, 80, 90 degree day, and then the next day it goes right back to you know 50 degrees. We're supposed to have a couple of days in a row though. That would be nice. Okay, so these guys are going to catch up in the middle. Alright, I'm going to run this guy over to this corner. And hopefully that other combine is done unloading into that truck, which it looks like it might be. Either that or that truck's full. Ah, truck can't be full. Alright, let's get him. Get him moving again. I guess you can stay there. You're not in the way. Okay, what's happening with these corn headers, these corn combines are just, they just stop for no reason unless he's stuck on the, oh he may be stuck on the tarmac again yeah, see he gets, they get stuck on that
silly things. Alright, next, he's full. And where's our trailer? Um, is this him? This is him. Yeah, these guys are going to catch up real soon here because if you notice, there's only a couple swaths left in the middle here. All right, same thing, I gotta stop this guy. He's going to be okay till he gets up to that berm, and I'm not quite sure what he's going to do. And I'm thinking, well, I don't know what to do with this guy. Because they're going to, they're really soon, they're going to get caught up with each other. It's just the shape of this farm here that's going to mess it up. Where'd that other combine go? No, seriously, where did he go? Alright, so... Um, yeah, let's take this guy, all right, I'm going to stop this guy. And I'm just going to run him straight across. Hope that other guy doesn't catch up. Oh, he's going to catch up. Um, Take him also up to the end. Now I'm going to let that guy finish what's left on that part. This guy, we're going to move up. And place him in here at this point. And then we'll take, what's he doing? Oh, I guess he's okay. And then we'll take this guy and let him continue on from here. Yeah, this is going to be a little tricky right here. 
just a little bit. Alright, let's see if I can do this before that other guy catches up to me. Right there. I'm going to... I'm going to square this part of the field up a little bit, I think. And then I'm going to take this part in the middle and cut it up. And I'm cutting this field into three parts and letting these guys each finish their own. That's what I'm going to do. So. Let's see what this part even looks like. He may be done already. I don't know. Okay. Uh, he's pretty close to being done right here. All right, let's have him go the other way and go for it right here. Oh, no, 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 no. He's not gonna do what I want him to do. Yeah, there's not much of this field left here on this side. So, I'll just, I just don't want the combines running into each other because they're getting close to that point. I'm trying to uh, get it done as efficiently as I can. We'll check on these corn guys. This guy's going to come to the point where he's going to hit that berm. Not, not, not quite sure what he will do. All right, so we need to find a corn truck. There's one right there. And then, while we're waiting for that, let's get him started. Take him over to field 20, was it? truck's not in the way. And this is another kind of a weird shaped field. So, um, I don't know. I'm going to have to, this is going to be a little weird. I may have to do this manually. I'll get it started this way and see what happens. I just got to remember not to leave him very long. This is not really that big a field. So I'm not quite sure what he'll do. Yeah, I didn't think there was much to this field left. Now, how'd he get over here? I should have stopped that. Oh, he's not doing what he's he's not doing what I wanted him to do. Well, that's okay. Let's go back to. Uh, shoot. Let's go back to this guy. Yeah. 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 Quit it. Don't give me a button because I'll push it. try to square this up a little bit and let him go. These are the trees that um, you can't drive through. 
so. way maybe I know this is going to look weird but I'm trying to square it off so that I can just hire a worker to go up and down up and down finish up this guy they're gonna be button heads I I don't know I'm gonna I'll go ahead and put him back to work but I wonder why he's this the other one just ran right through this oh I know why Maybe I don't. Okay. I just want you to finish this one more area right here. Don't get carried away. Alright, this guy's ready to be unloaded, so there must be a truck close by. And not this one. Oh, he's full. Pretty much. Um, where's this guy at? Where in the heck is this guy at? Oh! Bottom side of field five. Told you, I've got equipment spread over Hell's Half Acre. What's he gonna do up there? Go straight? No, turn. 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 Is he turning? He's turning. Alright, that's what I want him to do. Okay, let's go dump this stuff. And then we'll take this to field 18 for that corn. Pretty exciting harvest. We're going to have a ton of canola in the next episode, or the next harvest, I should say. Might not be the next episode, but... Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. I wonder what canola weighs. It's pretty compact. It might weigh more than other grains.
Canola. Oh, wait a minute. That's Ricola. Ricola, that's different than canola. I did, I, I'm surprised. I had more corn uh, seeded than I thought I did for only two combines. Hey, don't run off on me. I'm just picking up your corn. Don't run away. There you go. How are we doing over here? That's his last swath. This guy here. That's his last swath. And then all, we, all we'll have is this little spot in the middle here. And he sees it. Good job. All right, let's get this guy back to harvest. And another weird shaped field. So I think what I'm gonna try to do is to come over here and square it up somehow. Probably easier to do on the other end. And it appears I've got more trees I can't drive through, so I gotta be careful here. And it's got a little bit of a tail on the end, too, all going it all. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to kind of take this field and just kind of square it off right here. trying to do the least amount manually that I need to, to to keep the hired workers working. So far, I've been able to keep them moving quite steadily. It's been kind of tough, management-wise, jumping back and forth. But we knew the job was dangerous when we took it. And it is. I saw a Modern Marvel thing. They were talking about uh, safety boots, I think, or something like that. And, uh, and what did they say? Farming is the number four most dangerous job uh, in the nation. As far as uh, injuries and, and and death, yeah, I don't remember when that was filmed, but I think it was filmed in like two thousand eight or something like that. It was a uh, Netflix thing I was watching. Okay, now I think I can just kind of hire this guy. Let him go to town. See how everybody else is doing. Okay, so this is... His little part of the world is done. So, let's... Get him up to a tractor. Oh, he not done. He got a little triangle here. Got a little soul patch to handle.
And I'm guessing we probably don't need this anymore. Is he full? He may be. Why not get much in him? Nah, he's still got room. Brakes! Brakes! Man, these things have lousy brakes. Alright, let's see. Okay, he reached the berm, so... Let's... Finish this little part off, and then we'll head up to the next one. And he's leaving quite a bit of corn. I wonder if he'll play nice with. Uh, with uh, auto combine now. Let's see if he'll finish that area off. All right, let's get him started. And we don't need talk on it. Don't need that anymore. Start him. that and let's get our trailer what's this guy doing he just finished what uh, field three okay yeah you can wait there for a while this guy's chuck full So, Jimmy Crack Corn, we're going to take it to the silo. Yeah, now, now see these blue guys, when they're full, look, he's struggling pretty hard. And that's why I say I was trying to replace those cases, uh, the blue ones with the cases. They're a little bit more powerful tractor. But even the cases struggle when this trailer is full. Just not quite as bad as the... Uh, New Hollands. Uh-oh. Is, is that cedar stuck? Where did he go? Man, he's stuck in the bushes. It's going to take a while. Bear with me. Come on. Go faster. We need a turbocharger. Come on. Oh, he's picking up speed now. You go. You go. 13. 14. 15, come on, 16, 16 miles per hour, come on, one more, nope, going back to 15, oh, all the way down to 4, 3, oh my god, it's a struggle, look, he's spinning out, wow, that's a heck of a load, Let's go check on that cedar. Wherever he's at. Yep, he's stuck. He was trying. Wait a minute. This field's right down here, isn't it? Uh, let's see if I can sneak through these trees right here. Yeah, we're coming down. Got uh, a third of 18 done. Alright, 
you can sit right here for the time being. And let's see, let's get you. Okay, now uh, the corn was 100%, canola's only 89. And, you know, even the, even the case struggles with the weight of these trailers. But it's got just a little bit more oomph than those New Hollands. I just wonder what we're going to get for this harvest. Uh oh. Get out of the way. Okay, so, yeah, there's no way to completely be accurate in a test because this is only 89% where the corn was 100% but already he's doing 17, 18, 19, 20. Alright, let's go down get this guy back to work. You go back to work, finish this field up here. got enough room to carry on. Find out. Man, we'll head back up and get the rest of the canola off field five. And then we need to start a cedar on field five. And I've got a cedar sitting on field six, I believe. Cedar over there. Okay. patch right here. Okay, you guys just wait there. I'm almost there. I'm coming. I'm coming. All right, let's go check on corn guy. Ooh, he's on. He's 85 percent. 
and this one is ready to button up. I don't have my transportation courses anymore, so I can't just let them roam. But I think I'm just going to get him off the field for now. Drop him off at farm number two over here. They need a washing. Okay, what happened here? What is he doing? He's, uh... Where in the hell am I? What's he doing clear over here? That's weird. What's he doing in this field? He's supposed to be working that field over there. How'd that happen? He don't like auto wash, I guess. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do that one by hand. So, let's see here if we can do... Um, for some reason, auto, uh, auto Combine doesn't like these headers. That's the only thing I can think of because it works fine with the with wheat headers. You put a corn header on here and it doesn't quite work. So, let's get up here and let this guy go to work. Wait a minute, what are you doing? Yeah, stop that. I'm not quite sure what it's going to do here. We may have to completely go manual. Them buttoned up. And this guy, this is the last of the canola, I think. There went swoosh. Perfect timing, I guess. So, I'm pretty sure this is the last of the canola, and then all we've got left is the corn. And uh, we're looking at field 21. 18 and 19. We've got 18, almost a third done. We've got at least uh, 21 is about at least a half done. So we're moving down to the end of this harvest. Um, hope you had fun. Hope you're having fun on your farm. If you uh, get a chance, give me a like. It always is helpful. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and if you've got some friends, give it a share. In the meantime, I'll see you on the farm in the next episode.